now 185 for New Jersey. And that makes this next match at 130 all the more interesting. Two junior national champions getting ready to go at it. Willie Saxton of Ohio will wear the red ankle bands. Billy Murphy of California will wear the green. He's in the black uniform. He's from LaGrange, California. Went to Houston High School. He's also active in the drama and the band. So not only is he a great wrestler, he's involved in other activities. Willie Saxton, as you mentioned, was a champion here last year as a junior, but also a junior national champion in the summer, I believe, and an Ohio State champion this year. Murphy, the smaller of the two, low center of gravity, kind of makes your strike zone a little bit smaller. Just makes Saxton figure a better way in instead of straight on. Pretty impressive physiques on these guys. He's got a lot of matches under belt. Forty seconds gone here. No real shots yet. Getting the idea that this is not the kind of match we're likely to see many points scored. Both wrestlers for the first minute just sparring, looking, coming out at angles, trying to figure a way in. Now Murphy bull rushes to the underhook. Trying to throw by, that didn't work. Murphy seems a little bit more aggressive, or at least he's going forward a little bit more. Got the front headlock on Saxton, trying to tripod out of it and does. Down to 35 seconds left in the first period, still scoreless. And as with all the finalists, with the exception of one match, these guys haven't wrestled before, each other at least. Nice oh, duck. Not, wow. Beautiful Real duck. Real sweet. Real sweet. That is Very too. quick. Look, nice low duck under. Very quick. He did that out of wrist control, and he hit it. Murphy, without a doubt, real quick twitch. Now, uh, now with seven seconds left in the first period, Murphy will try to ride him out here and take a two-to-nothing lead to the second. Which is off. Oh, oh uh, but Saxton gets out. That was a pretty short order. Yeah, seven seconds to go. You gotta you almost treat that like a ride out. You just hold on. The ref doesn't care a whole lot. And uh, that one point could come back to haunt him. They got four minutes to go. Looks like it was Murphy's choice there, and he took the bottom. Murphy just a uh, tripod stand up, cut and faced him. Score three to one. This a match that looks like it's going to be decided on the feet. Obviously, Saxton uh, no interest in trying to ride Murphy, and uh, he escaped very quickly with seven seconds left in the first. Now, where Saxton made the mistake before, where he got taken down, taken down was he stood in front of him. And now he's going to a knee, and maybe he's going to work out at angles. But Murphy wants him to stand in front of him. Nice high cross shot. Um, Murphy, once again, with just that low center of gravity, just popped his hip and got right out of there. That build, he's got a very low, like you said, a low center, and uh, he's using that to his advantage. He's got 100 pounds between his chest and his knees. <laughs> A minute 10 left in the second period. Still three to one. The score in favor of Billy Murphy of California. And remember, more than just a individual championship on the line here for Murphy, he could really put some distance between California and New Jersey in this team race with a victory. Well, and also to mention, Ohio's in third place. 
Uh, I don't think they can threaten for the lead. They could certainly score second. They have three finalists. This is their first to three. Jerry Moore thinking uh, Saxton should be doing a little more than he is. And I just think he's just, and I, and I agree with Saxton, um, you, you've got to uh, calculate your move at this point because he's been popped, he's been hit, uh, he's been scrambled against, and now he's, he's got to select a better shot. Ten seconds left in the second period now. Murphy dives in again on a leg. Five, four, three, two, one, and that will do it for period number two. So now Saxton likely will start down. He will. He trails three to one. This is the 130-pound championship match in the National High School Wrestling Championships, the National High School Seniors Wrestling Championships from the Peterson Event Center here in Pittsburgh. Rob Sherrill, Ed Ferraro, Martin Fleming on the call. And the third period is underway. The wrestlers, you got Billy Murphy and Willie Saxon gets the escape to narrow the score to three to two. Murphy um, yeah, didn't demonstrate that he wanted to really hang on top um, very long. And some one of you fellows mentioned it earlier, uh, this match was going to be on his feet, and it sure is. The deal being, uh, Murphy's demonstrating uh, a real master of shutting down Saxton, and that was Ooh, sweet. Nice, right to a double, double leg, right. Oh, beautiful. He changed levels there and just attacked in so quickly. It was kind of a duck under, but just a low attack. He just had Saxton reach, and uh, he just went, you hit it. Couple different shots for Murphy here. A minute 15 left to go. Scored with the duck under in the first period. Here with the nice level change to the double leg and his second takedown of the match in a five to two lead. Oh my, that was, uh, we got a front row of view of that. I mean, it was right in front of us and a very aggressive attack and effective. Murphy cuts him loose. Like you said, he's very comfortable on his feet, and I think he likes to stay in that neutral position, especially as much as possible with a really good wrestler like uh, Willie Saxton. He's now put Saxton in the position where Saxton would have to score two takedowns to get an advantage here. And there's a shot. Boy, he pops him with that hip. I mean, that was a decent shot. He was deep enough, and Murphy just popped him with his hip, and all of a sudden you're three feet away. Shot and a reshot by Saxton. Neither, of course, get through. 35 seconds left to go now. Now Murphy's going under hooks. Uh, you're going to see uh, a real good shutdown in here unless he does one of his, his uh, real quick shots. Uh, you're going to see a, a, a shutdown of Saxton. And stalling against Saxton. A point for Murphy makes it 6-3. to three. And Murphy spins behind and gets another two. That, that stall call, Saxton made a poor choice uh, shot, head down, and uh, Murphy just kind of snapped and went behind. Seven seconds left to go now. And Billy Murphy, it looks like, will repeat in the high school nationals, a junior national champion and two seconds away from being a senior national champion. You can see why he was a uh, name most outstanding wrestler. Last year, he really dominated his opponent there in the finals. And that will do it by a score of eight to three. Billy Murphy of California wins this battle of defending junior national champions eight to three over Willie Saxton of Ohio. That was an impressive win. And that's an impressive four points for California.